Good morning everyone, back in uh, another YouTube video. It's been a while since I've filmed one of these, but today is week four primary day. The caffeine has not hit me yet, so I'm a little, a little groggy still. Um, just ate breakfast, and today is going to be one of the hardest sessions I've had in the past, say, six months since I competed. So stay tuned for this entire video because the entire video, we're gonna have a lot of energy, a lot of uh, motivation, a lot of hype, and I'm really excited. We got Chris Stewart here with me today. Uh, Bam's coming at the gym, he slept in a little bit, but but yeah, not much to say. I'm, gonna, I'm not going to do too much talking in between my lifts because I need to really focus in today, but Dom's going to be recording as much as he can uh, for the PC video, so hope you guys enjoy. Alright, we're in the gym now. It's time to start the workout. Today on squats, I have to do a top set of four RP, like eight and a half, I think. Um, last week I did 242 kilos for a top set of four and it moved a lot better than I thought. Today, I got a big range. I'm not gonna tell you what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna, you guys are gonna watch and you're gonna pay attention and then you're gonna enjoy. Cause I'm gonna fucking smoke this shit and I feel really good right now. Um, I'm gonna take my pre-workout. You'll see the ads later on. I'm, I, don't, I just wanna dial in and I don't wanna really talk too much. But gonna warm up. Dom's gonna be with me too. You can see every single step of the way and hopefully smoke something sexual today. Let's get it on. I'm still trying to collect myself after that uh, squat session. So I had to do a top set of four, a top back off set of two, and two back off sets of four. So that's literally over 10 reps of 500 pounds-ish. God damn, I'm busting my ass right now with training. And I feel fantastic, I feel phenomenal. Everything is going great and I'm dialing everything in I can outside of the gym to make sure that my performance inside of the gym is doing fantastic. I'm really happy with the result from my squat session for today. Squat, as you guys have known me for the longest time, is the one lift that gives me the most anxiety, stresses me out the most. Um, this is a fantastic end to the block, the very tip top of the top range I selected today and I smoked it. So I'm very, very happy with that. Leading is a rising tide, I'm not gonna be doing squat singles, I'm gonna be doing reps. And I just respond so much better to reps. So we're gonna see how that translates into this meat prep. It's gonna be the first time I'm doing this, a meat prep without squat singles. Holy shit, that sounds so unorthodox. But I'm gonna work up to my bench single now. This entire block, bench has been so fucked, like in fucking finicky. Um, so we decided to call an audible and start our sixth bench day this week. So week three, I started doing my, my sixth bench day. It's not gonna have any carryover to today's session, I think, but, excuse me, but Hopefully I can still bench something good, clean up last week. I'm still gonna try to take 182, 185 today and then hit something nice. And then the fun's gonna happen again with deadlifts. I'm very excited for deadlifts today. Bam's waiting for me, so I have a, I have a good training partner today to deadlift with. But we're gonna bench first, do our top set, and then I'll keep you guys posted before I start deadlifting. What the hell? Don't wait up my arch. Why am I hanging my back isn't already warm, bro? It's already warm. What are you doing? Look at that. That meat. The fucking... This is like prime beef right here, dude. This is like the shit you get at the farmer's market. 
I'm gonna make as much intimate eye contact with you as I can. So it makes you feel like you're engaged in the video the entire time. <laughs> guys I don't I didn't get to talk in between bench and deads because I you know like um, we need to really lock in and you need to hyper focus on whatever you're doing it's exactly what I had to do because when I uh, after I finished squatting I got to the point where um, my vision was like a vignette that's what, that's what it was like I was like I couldn't see anything besides what was right in front of me and I was like tripping over things and like blacking out kind of but um, yeah, it's powerlifting for you guys. If you guys uh, have never experienced that, you're not a powerlifter. I'm just joking, but bench went phenomenal. I did a top set with 182 and a half kilos. If you guys saw my post last week on Instagram, I did not do that great on bench. And uh, I cleaned it up this week. I felt a lot better. And back off top set with 167 for a set of four, which was smoke, like RP8, which is crazy for me. And then we moved on to deadlifts, which is probably the most fun lift I've had the entire day. Um, I was surprised with the way that it moved and felt. I went one, two, three, four, five reds again, which is like a mental like thing. Like I now I can take these big boy jumps and I'm happy again because I'm confident and I'm strong. But I went all the way up to 270 for my last warm ups, my, my warm ups, and then I went to 292 and a half for my top set of two, and I smoked it. It was better than my top double last week, which I'm really, really happy about. I've been really struggling with uh, the bar kicking away from me with heavier weights, but today I was just absolutely locked in. Um, couldn't ask for a better session. If you guys have made it all the way to the end of this video, why the hell have you not subscribed or liked or dropped a comment to support me? Because that's, I'm not asking for you to buy anything. I'm not asking for you to do anything. Just 
Support me by interacting and engaging with my YouTube content because I want to perform well on this platform. This is my favorite place to create content on. Um, although it's not my best one, obviously Instagram is the best place where I post the most content and it's the best, but I want to keep posting these long form videos because this is the most fun for me to make. And now since I'm officially hiring Dom as my videographer, um, we're going to be a little bit more consistent with things going forward. Probably starting off like once a week for now until things happen. I haven't really talked too much about things, but yeah, once a week for now until things get a little bit more stable, but that's the end of the block. If you guys are still watching the video, I appreciate you guys so much. Really, really appreciate it. That's it for this video. Let me know what you guys want to see going forward in the future. I'll see you next time. See you.